<coughs> Get rolling with more actors and actresses addition to the wheel right now. Miranda Cosper was back as the returning champ. This time, she's being faced off by two faces. Two new faces that have appeared. Against Ian James Corlett and Julie Kavner. All right. Good luck to you guys as we begin. Let's get on with the game. <clears throat> and as always, for the first round, top dollar value is $1,000. We're playing for cash, and let's get set to our first puzzle, which is before and after. And we drew numbers for the show to see who would go first. Ian James Corlett, you drew the first number, so spin it. All right. Four hundred. N. No N. Break for you, Miranda Cosgrove. Champ. <coughs> Five hundred. T. Yes, we have three T's. Wait, there are four. Four T's. Okay, I'll spin. Seven hundred. S. Three S's. <clears throat> I'd like to buy an A. Uh huh. Two A's. Five hundred. R? Yes. One R. I'd like to buy an I, please. Uh huh. Three I's. I'll spin. Five hundred. No, no. Actually, not five hundred. Seven. No, no. Eight hundred. An L? There's one L. <clears throat> I'll spin. Nine hundred. H. Is there an H? Yes, there's two of them. Um, I like to solve. Okay, go ahead. What is love at first sight? Yep, you got it. This is an interesting puzzle. What is love and love at first sight? That's our puzzle for before and after. <coughs> and uh, now it's time to move on to play the next round. So we have more actors and actresses wheel coming. Stay with us. <coughs> Round two is in session. We got a $2,500 space that's been added to the wheel. And when you guys could get this awesome prize that's been placed on the wheel, if you're the one who solves the puzzle without getting a bankrupt, it is yours. And let's take a look at the next puzzle now. This time it's a phrase, and Miranda Cosgrove will start this round. <clears throat> 500. Is there an N? Yes, one N. All right. Oh, a free spin. Well, first we need a letter. R. Uh-huh. One R. You may pick up that free spin and put it right down in front of you. Let us know when you want to use it. And uh, what would you like to do? Spin. Seven hundred. T. There's no T. And uh, hang on, Julie Kavner. We're having a free spin being used by Miranda Cosgrove here. Pass it on down and spin the wheel. Four hundred. L. No L. Julie Kavner. Four hundred. L. 
Wait, hang on. That letter has already been called. Oh, well. Ian James Corlett. Oh, no, 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 bankrupt. Oh. Dratty spin. Randa Cosgrove. Prize, but we need a letter first. <clears throat> H. Pick up that prize. There is one H. Put it down in front of you, and if you're the one who solves the puzzle without puzzle, if you're the one who solves the puzzle without hitting a bankrupt, that prize will be yours. Eight hundred. W. W. Yes. Two of them. I'd like to buy an O. Yeah, there are four O's. Three hundred. I like a Y. Okay, two Ys. I'll spin once more. Okay, Miss Cosgrove. Well, three hundred. K? Yeah, one K. And um, with that selection you made, you left us with everything else. It's a vowel, so solve it. You know who you are. Yes, I do. You got it. Ah, oh, I sure, I sure thought you would know this. And this cool prize you picked up off the wheel was a set of golf clubs worth. No, 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 not golf clubs. It's actually a set of jewel. Was jewelry worth? Sixteen hundred dollars. We'll add that to your total and move on to the next round. So stay with us. <coughs> Back for our third round. We have a thirty-five hundred dollars space on the wheel, and let's take a look at our next category. It is next line, please, and we'll start with Julie Kavner. Hey. Oh wait. 400. Now, before you call your letter, I forgot there were two apostrophes in this puzzle. All right. Now, which letter are you going to crave? <laughs> um, wait a minute. The apostrophe was actually meant to go here. Okay. Now, choose your letter. I'd like an R, please. One R. A spin. 250. Hmm. L. There's no L, and it is Ian James Corlett's turn. 700. An S. There's no S. Miranda Cosgrove, big break for you, champ. 400. <coughs> is there an N? Yeah, there are four N's. Six hundred. T. There are three T's. I like to buy a vowel. All right. E. Uh-huh. One E. I'll spin. Seven hundred. An S. Uh huh. There's one S. I'd like to buy an A. Yeah, there are lots of A's up there. Let's see how many. There are five of them. Last letter. Actually, Ian James Corlett Lock. Guest, uh, P. 500. 
like a C. Three C's. I like to buy an O. Oh my gosh, there are seven O's. <laughs> Spin. Oh, you, how about that? 3,500. A K. Yes, three Ks. I'll solve. Okay, go ahead. But a nook can't read, so a nook can't cook. Yep, that's it. Whoa, this puzzle happened to be uh, a gimme for you, Miss Cosgrove. <laughs> I can tell it was because you're cracking up. Now, before we can continue on to the next round, you do know the category is next line, please, and you do have a chance for an extra 500 if you can guess what would come next. So what good to a nook is a hook cookbook? <coughs> yeah, you got it right again, Miss Cosgrove, and that gives you an extra $500. So now are we ready to move on to the next round? We are indeed, so don't go anywhere. Hi there. Back for our fourth round with a $5,000 space on the wheel. And here's our category for this round. It's things. Start us off, Ian James Corlett. $400. Um, is there a T? No. No T. Miranda Cosgrove. $400. R. Nope. Your turn, Julie Havner. <laughs> 700. C? No C's. And, um, oh! Hang on there, Ian James Corlett. I hear a sound that means that time is running short. So I'll give the wheel a final spin. I'll ask you to give me letters for the puzzle. I'll find seconds to solve it. Vowels worth nothing. Consonants worth not bad. $700 a piece. A nice, tidy sum with you guys. Every letter very important. It just keeps getting interesting. Things is the category, and Ian James Corlett, you'll start with a letter, please. S. One S. You have five seconds. Things. Here's the Miranda Cosgrove. N? Yes, two N's. Things. Julie Kavner. L? One L. Everybody with some money. Things. Pie needles? Yes, you got it. A little gravy for you. Oh, this puzzle happened to be a a gimme for you. <laughs> you got this right off the bat, did you? I sure did. <laughs> now let's tally up the scores. Miranda Cosgrove, you're a big winner, so let's go on and play the bonus round. <clears throat> big win for you, Miss Cosgrove. Mm -hmm. You're keeping up your winning streak quite well. And now it's time to see you go for a bonus prize. Choose the envelope you want. I'll go with the W. Go for the W, okay? Hand me that, and we'll get right to work on this puzzle, which is a thing. R-S-T-L-N-E. Got some of those up there? All right. Now see if you can give me some more now. We need three more consonants and a vowel. C. H. D. And your vowel. I. Okay, I think you're going to get a little help here, but home viewers, please don't assist her. Oh, wait, hold on. The H is all you're going to get, and that's it. Well, just talk it out. Just give me as many, give it as many guesses as you can in 10 seconds. It's a thing. Good luck. 
Hmm. Hit blue. Hot blue. Hot. <clears throat> well, the O was right. The actual answer was hot glue. Oh, it was hot glue. Oh, well. Here's what you lost out on, Miss Cosgrove. It was a set of watches worth $14,000. But listen, Miss Cosgrove, you did do well. You're still our first place finisher. So uh, we'll see you, home viewers, again when Actors and Actresses Wheel continues.